outcome be? How might I best achieve? How can I improve? What is, not if, is? Be specific, always. So if we now look at how we answer our questions, we are going to ask a specific question and we are going to answer it specifically and directly. We are, uh, this applies to any system, so it doesn't matter that I'm using the Kipper cards, for example, if you use the Norman Tarot, this is what makes a great reader. If you ask a health question, you answer it with a health interpretation. If you ask a love question, you answer it with a love interpretation. Home, home interpretation. Work, work interpretation. It's that easy. So if we look at the cards and ask for a health reading for me for the coming week. Hold great water. His thoughts. And home. So, we are now talking about a health reading. So we start with Hope Great Water. I know that my significator looks this way in uh, Kipper, that's why I've only laid the three cards. Uh, Hope Great Water in illness and his thoughts and house in illness. So the first thing that's really noticeable is his thoughts, which is of a mental nature. So we are probably talking something of a mental nature for here for me. Hope Great Water is often used as an addiction card or a dependence card. So we could say that I am dependent on some kind of psychological or um, mental health <laughs> issue this week. Um, and house can signify the body. So we're looking at um, perhaps some form of tablets for a head issue because his thoughts is his head that affect the whole body. So we could say I would be taking some headache tablets this week, for example, uh, which will have an effect on my whole body. You see how we've used these just in a health interpretation nothing more let's look at these if we were going to interpret them on a work read hope great water wish fulfillment his thoughts planning home the office so we could be seeing in a work read not using the health meanings now that we could see that some plans come to fruition fruition his plans in the workplace. Again, we have interpreted, interpreted them in a purely work scenario. Now let's look at love. Again, we have wish fulfillment or from afar. His thoughts, romantic thoughts from afar, come home. It could be that uh, your main character is hoping and planning a trip home to see their loved ones and that could be your love read for example so now let's do a work read for me and we're going to specifically ask a question for my working week and we are going to answer it with a work interpretation convene again I know that my main character faces this way so I start from these cards and again, you can use this with Tarot, you can use this with uh, Lenormand. My working week. My working week is seeing me coupling something up with my work, but there's something <laughs> absolutely wrong this coming week. Could be this the week between Christmas and New Year and work doesn't come easy to me. Uh, our couple here don't have a connector card but that would be our significator here so connecting me and work I will get some connections done, I will get some meetings done or I uh, may get more videos done. 
this week. But there will be something inherently wrong with these because uh, she's at the end hiding this behind the door. So maybe I have some secret work uh, connections this week. Finally, let's have a look at my love life this week. Remember, we're asking a specific question and answering it specifically. So, my love life this week, please. Win loss. So, we have some abundance there. Ooh. Our little disruptor. Ooh, look at this. I hope I'm not going to have lots of arguments with my husband. Um, this could be a few things. In front of me we have win lots, so I am uh, abundant here. I am giving off abundant thoughts. Perhaps my husband is a little cold this week or uh, is blocking the relationship a little bit this week. The, uh, we can tie these two together so we can have lots of conflict, perhaps. Or just generally uh, a usual week with married couples and there's abundance and there's some forms of blockages together. The most important thing is that me and my husband are facing one another in an auspicious placement and he is in my week, which is very good to hear. So remember, whichever system you use, you use the specific answers to the specific questions. Uh, if we look at Lenormand quickly here, as they lay, snake jumps out there. Can be betrayal in a love uh, situation, can also be your intestines in a health reading. We have a bouquet, can be a nice pleasant surprise or everything you wished for. Uh, in a relationship reading, for example, it can also be your stomach flora. Uh, we have, let's have a look, fish. Fish can be abundance, of course. Uh, at its core, it is abundance. can also be diarrhea. Again, our stomach coming in. Uh, we have our gnawing mice who gnaw away at things. This can be rotting and decaying in a health reading, for example. Our love commitment, if we are having, doing a love reading, we have the commitment here or a relationship, a committed relationship. And in a work read, this could be your work commitment. So we are really looking at pulling out the information from the essence of the card to answer specifically your question.